Illich is leading his chosen on foot here versus the warband of Wolfric and his howly skin wolf boys. All right, all right, all right. Let's do this. Like I said, we got chosen. Three of them. We got blues. We got pink fire. We got infernal gateway. Infernal gateway. Kind of sucks right now, <laughs> thinking about it. But you know what? Marauder champions kind of scare me. Speaking of Marauder champs, we got two with great weapons. Javelins, a bunch of Marauders, and more Marauders with more Javelins. Two armored skin wolves, Wolfric hiding in the woods. And we got... How many flamers? Oh, we don't have flamers. We have two pinks, or two blues, and two spawn. Maneuver over to the side that is weakest so we can capture those points. Javelins are ready, trying to do javelin things. Gotta take them off fire at will. Chosen will beat back anything thrown at them. Maybe not champions with great weapons, probably not. But we got some stuff for that. Immediately sending in Chosen to come beat up on javelins, and then we're sending in fire to also beat up on javelins. So there's not gonna be that many javelins left after this. Two spawn to just hold down the side objective. Probably could send them in to start beating up Marauders or Wolfric. On the side, we bring in Flamers for some reason. Honestly, that's a huge mistake. We could have sent it into the center. And actually, we should have sent it to the center to come reinforce anything. I'm trying to jump, uh, drop in on my blues. And yeah, huge mistake of my end. I could even send it on the side here to go burn those Marauders. But Vanguard, Norsk, and Ice Wolves, or just Ice Wolves in general, would be a problem. And they get intercepted by, looks like... I'm not sure yet. Blue's getting hit with the javelins, but we're gonna fix that soon. Trying to shoot into Wolfric, but that's a huge mistake, because, uh... I don't think Wolfric's... I think he's on his horse, so... Should be fine. Wolfric's getting beat down by the spawn. As he should. Villa's just absolutely beating the shit out of all these Marauders with great weapons. Actually, he's doing pretty well. Oh, that's why. They have spawn in the mix. It's like, wow. They should be losing. Marauders getting absolutely trampled in by these Centigors. Centigors coming in. Skid Wolves finally coming in now. And we're going to burn those boys. Going to give them that Hawk Tua from the Flamers. <laughs> burn them good. Screamers coming in. Screamers versus Armored Skid Wolves. Eh, I think Skid Wolves win that. But now that we're supporting them, it should be fine. Pink Fire is coming down. What the hell happened to my... Uh... Oh, that's what happened. They're, uh... Yeah. Wolfric did his uh, little lore boats down on my blues, which got rid of them, well, most of them, and we're just going to send the blues into fighting those javelins, which they should win, maybe, maybe. Yeah, big mistake trying to do a fight over here, we should have just kept the side objective, honestly. Skid Wolves are not having a good time, right? er, Skid Wolves, yeah, the Skid Wolves aren't having a good time, but neither are my Screamers. Javelin's able to shoot freely, which is a huge problem. We'll get some more pink fire on top of them soon enough. And then it looks like Wolfric's just having a fun time supporting. That should be too bad. I do like the spawn so far. They're doing pretty solid. Good pink right there. Wish I had another one to blow back those ones up there. And here it comes, the final trans, the absolute bane of all chaos factions. Uh, for the mere 600, maybe even 475 points, you can get a foot lore that can overcast Final Trans and pay for itself three times over. <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of spells or abilities that are basically uninteractable, if that makes sense. I think in game design, it's pretty fair to say that things that you can't interact with aren't exactly the best designed and final trench just feels like one of those spells heck even buna got nerfed to shit i wouldn't say to shit but it definitely got a well well deserved nerf because you just can't stop a lord from casting a spell that absolutely dumpsters a expensive unit that's why no one ever took any elite monsters or anything because buna just shits on them same with final trans final final trans i think Ugh. Absolute dog shit. That's why the Skull of Katam on the Sorcerer of Zeech got nerfed from 120 to 60. Because, man, that spell is just absolutely ball busters. Speaking of ball busters, Apostate here is just putting me down like the damn dirty dog I am. It looks like he's going to win this. I'm losing points. I'm losing in value. I have less units than he does. He's going to do another final trans there. 
beat up on my poor Chosen. Chosen have definitely overextended themselves. And so have I. Bringing more blues right now, but at this point, it's probably going to be GG's. I think my build would have been fine had I not just committed to the right side. If I would have just stayed and reinforced the center in the middle, I would have been absolutely fine. It's just... Me not giving a shit and just going for <laughs> whatever I felt like. Oh boy. This is what happens when I get too overconfident. Here come the flamers! Burn those dogs! We're gonna have some hot dogs right now. And they have weakness to fire, and that didn't do jack shit for damage. That's insane. Who's coming in? Village getting crushed. As soon as Village is crushed, I know it's game over. Sense of course, each will be back to the Famir, but Famir already beaten. There's really not much else I can do. I'm gonna get hit with a two pronged attack from both sides. Marauders and these skin wolves are just absolute bonkers. So yeah, we're probably gonna fast forward here soon and then call it a game. GG's apostate, GG's. Uh Final Trans. Is it OP? Let me know. There's definitely matchups where they should be done, but at the same time it's just you know Maybe that's just the problem in game design itself when you're forced to bring something that can't be interacted with. I don't know how they would make Final Trans interactable. Maybe just lower this Winds of Magic and then the damage so it can balance out. I don't know. I'm not a game design. I do know some fundamentals, but that's about it. Alright, folks. If you enjoy the one, please like, sub, follow me here on YouTube, Around the Road 1000. Come join on the Discord, come play some games, or just show some love on the stream. You can do 1v1s or 2v2s, it's up to you. Alright, folks, with all that said... Hope y'all have a good one. Peace, and goodbye for now.